Time now to meet Aucklander Martin Adlington, a very dedicated planet-saving crafter who's firmly focused on minimising waste to save our natural world. Martin Adlington is a dumpster diving Aucklander with three main messages, reduce, reuse and resell. He has now spent the last 10 years as an environmental crafter, turning other people's trash into a living and showing New Zealanders how easy it is to reuse. As kids, we lived near a dump, used to find the most amazing things. And the stuff that I found in those days still inspires me to do exactly what we're going to do now, go in the trash. I started foraging pretty seriously in the inorganic and skips and finding all sorts of things to make sculptural and wall pieces out of. And the things I make now, I sell in boutique Kiviana stores here in Auckland. Every Thursday, rain or shine, Martin spends an hour dumpster diving for rubbish. I search the skip from top to bottom and uh, it's, it's amazing what's in here. A lot of the stuff isn't broken, it's quite usable. And last week I found an old crystal chandelier, which I've got hanging up at home. My trips aren't always successful, but I usually find something that I can turn into a clock or a sculpture or a piece of art, wall art, whatever. At 3pm, Martin packs up the van and on the way home, detours to Browns Bay to forage the beach. Now here's a jandal. This is a perfect example of, of what you find. You can punch a hole in that, cut it into a fish shape. It'll make a great wall piece or even a, a clock. Once Martin makes it home, he gets straight into business. So I make clocks out of all kinds of things. Uh, preferably things that are flat, like a frying pan, a tin, a tray. All I have to do is drill a hole, put the mechanism through, put the bolt on, put the hands on, and there you go. It's that simple. And there's also pendulums. So with the corned beef tins, I often use a, a plastic fork that swings, and that always gets a laugh. Recycling and reusing is a message that Martin wants to make New Zealand kids aware of. His work is a visual metaphor for this statement. I'm engaged at the moment in a, making a series of short YouTube videos to help change the way people think about rubbish, to educate them, give them some skills, and so they can do their little bit about changing the world or saving the world.